Christmas feeling. Hello, guys. Come on in. Come into my home. Now, this is my living room. And it's one of my favourite rooms in the house. But in fact, I work from home. And my home to me is a very, very important part of my life because it's a bit like a sanctuary. My home reflects my personality. Now, Christmas is such a magical time for me because really it just gives me the permission, if you like, to decorate the entire house. And pretty much every room gets a little bit of Christmas treatment. Now, come over here because I've got something a little bit special to show you. This is a Christmas tree that I've had delivered to my door from the Highlands of Scotland, if you please. And what makes this really special is a sustainable tree, which means that this one's been cut down, another one has been put in its place. When I was little, we had a tinsel tree which was brought out year after year after year, until I was 16, to the point it had actually no tinsel on it. So that's why I do have a little bit of a problem with tinsel in my own home. I think tinsel is brilliant, but not for me. The tree is such an important part of my Christmas and I really, really enjoy decorating it. And what I like to do, I like to have lots of lovely bright, bold colours. And every year I treat myself maybe to a couple of real special baubles. But the majority of my tree is made up of actually very cheap ones. Ones like these that you might pick up for maybe four pounds that you get 12 or 24 of. Because I like my tree to look really full of decorations. But first of all, we've got to start with the lights and I like a lot of them. Well, now we've got the lights on the tree, it's now for the baubles, my favourite bit, I must admit. Now, these are, in fact, my grandmother's, and they're over 100 years old, and I'm extremely fond of them. They're very precious to me. And all of my baubles are a bit of like an ongoing collection. I have a couple each year that I buy, but uh, all of them are quite precious, and I can't wait to get started. I just love doing this. I sort of love Christmas more and decorating it now because if I was ever fortunate enough to have children, I realised that this would never last five minutes. <laughs> so I suppose I'm just... It's indulging myself, really, and I don't spend masses of money on it, but I do like spending time on it. Well, I'm really pleased with my tree, but I think it's really important that it doesn't dominate the rest of the room. And that was why I got up at 5.30 this morning and I went to the flower market to get some extra ingredients so I can start decorating the rest of the room. Now, I'm using these and very simple components to dress this mantelpiece. Dead simple. Watch me do it. What is Christmas? Christmas is for caring. What is Christmas? Christmas is for sharing. What is Christmas? Can't now, how stress-free was that? I think the most important thing is to really think about what you've got in the house. Don't go out and buy loads of really expensive things. I think Where this is, is looking Christmas? quite Christmassy. But of course, there are many variations. And for another quick and simple mantelpiece, I have chosen to use a mixture of fur sprigs, butterflies and little birds to create an exotic arrangement. Making your own decorations does take a little bit of time and it's not all about money. You can do a lot of things with like a bit of tissue paper, wrapping it around a vase with a ribbon. If you don't have coloured vases, that sort of thing. It's just being a little bit inventive and getting your colours all together and just playing, really. Well, I love Christmas and I love it because of all the food and the presents. But most of all, I love decorating. To me, it's what makes Christmas so fantastically special. Cheers. And uh, as Andrew says, of course, it's important to be stress 
free. Uh, and, uh, and there's nothing lightens the atmosphere than a good cracker. Oh, I love a good cracker. And you guys love crackers last week, didn't well, you? Well, yes, like we love them so much we got told off for getting <laughs> in, the way, so in the way naughty. of the item. So you, talk us through.